everyone, oddly noted here. Sorry it's been so long since we last uploaded a video. I've been really busy preparing for the live performance that we had on March 29th and we want to thank everyone for tuning in and also for attending live if you were actually here in Phoenix. Today we take on a challenge, our first challenge. Maybe it's, maybe it's our second. This challenge is called the prom nail challenge. And it's pretty much to see how bad long nails are for a violinist. So the first part of this challenge is to um, test out short nails. I've only had short nails for most of my life because I've played for the violin for so long. The first and second finger are a little bit shorter and the third and fourth I still need to clip. So I'm going to go and take care of those and then we'll run through some simple things on the instrument. Okay, here we are. I'm all set. First thing we'll play is a scale. The next thing we're going to do is the slower selection. And finally, we're going to do a faster selection. Now that the short nail test is over, I say they work just fine. Something I've actually never done is put on fake nails. And so we're going to do that together today. It's actually covered in a layer of Elmer's glue just to protect them and allow me to take off the nails because I know that fake nails are not going to be the permanent solution to my nail beautification as a violinist. Here's the package that we're gonna use. I do not know what this brand is and they do not support me whatsoever. So I just thought they were pretty. Let's see. This can't be that hard, right? They're so fake. Mm. Packaging. Ugh. They're like not real. I mean, I'm glad they're not real, but ew. Contact with eye skin can bond in seconds. Do not breathe vapors. And I wonder why I don't do these on a regular basis. feels so fake, it hurts. First nail, done. Second nail. I don't know how anyone can do anything with these nails. Like, I can't touch my fingers. There's glue everywhere. Oh, gross. Pinky. They just don't look right. And my fingers feel like they are suffocating. Ow. 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 Oh, I hate these. <laughs> not my idea of fun. We now have two sets of nails. This one is not sticking at all, so I have a feeling that will be more than problematic for my bow hand anyway, so it's going to come off pretty soon. Here we go. First test, simple scale. two nails that are almost coming off. Now let's do the fast selection. It's as if you're your own plucking accompanist. Conclusions? Cut your nail. If you want to have pretty nails, aim for the thumbnail. It was hard to get around the instrument. It's hard to touch the strings. It was hard to feel where it was because the pad or the finger or the flush of the finger wasn't touching the strings, it was actually the nails that were trying to do the job. And the posture also was compromised to say the least. So if you're planning on wearing nails for prom, I would recommend artificial nails. And especially if you can get them off the next day, so you can go back to practicing without them. If you wanna use your natural nails, I wouldn't suggest that so much. I'm sure that they're a little bit easier to work with because they don't grow as long as perhaps these. You're still compromising your setup and your posture. And if you want to take the challenge and you think you can do better than I can, and I'm sure you can, go ahead and post it in the comments below. I'd love to see it. 
I would say that this was a complete failure and I hope you enjoyed watching it. Be sure to subscribe down below to Oddly Noted 7 and be sure to check us out Oddly Noted 7 on Facebook and Oddly Noted on Twitter. Thanks so much. Bye-bye. Look at that